Hi everyone, Lori Whitlock here. I wanted to show you these cute little tag bags that I have at the Silhouette Design Store and in my shop at shop.loriwhitlock.com in SVG format. I think these little bags are super fun for the upcoming holidays. We have um, a set of Halloween bags and a set of Thanksgiving bags and a set of Christmas bags. And these are really simple to put together. I'm gonna to show you how to do that here in just a minute. But these darling little boxes are about five inches tall, including the tag, um, including the, the little tag top piece on the box. And they're about an inch and a half deep and about, let's see, about three and a half inches wide. So they're really easy to put together. The cute little tags can be used for other things. You could go ahead and tie that on a package or um, another gift bag that you've bought, a bigger one um, from the store. Um, or they're darling on these little custom shaped gift bags. So let's get started putting these together and I hope you have fun making them. These little tag bags are so incredibly easy to put together. Um, all you have is your basic bag shape and it's got the cute little tag top on the front and back. And then you have your tag. And I love these tags because you can use them for so many more things other than just going on this bag. It works great with this bag, but if you wanted to add it to a store-bought bag or some other project or a present and tie it in the bow, um, the tags are just really cute for that as well. So um, this is what the tag bag looks like and you'll want to go ahead and fold towards the center on all the square marks and you'll notice on the sides there's some little gusseted sides so they um, valley fold in the middle and then they have the little triangle down at the bottom to help the bag sit properly. So once you have all of those folded and going the right direction, um, go ahead and Put your glue tab and go ahead and put some adhesive on it and put it down on the table and then just fold that tag bag side over and glue that down. And then you'll take these two sides and tuck them in and then the bottom pieces will tuck up and just glue in place like that. So then you'll probably want to use a little something to push down on those adhesive pieces so that they stick really well. So that is the design of the basic bag. And then you have your cute little tag and just go ahead and maybe ink around the edges and layer the cute little top piece on. And then we've used a little pop dot here for some dimension on the cute little icon. And this uh, pilgrim hat's particularly easy. It's just three pieces. Some of the other tags are a little more intricate and detailed. For instance, here's our pilgrim. Um, you can size these tags up and maybe even down a little bit. I believe the pilgrim hat is scaled down about 95% and the pilgrim is at 100% um, in the file. So you can see that he's got some pretty small pieces like his cuffs and his little collar and his shoes. Those are the smallest pieces so you wouldn't want to scale it down too far. Um, and this tag measures, let me give you a measurement on it real quick. It measures, this is the worst ruler, the numbers don't show very well, about three, a little less than three inches wide, so 2.75 by about five inches tall. So that's the size of the tag in the original file. Yeah, about five inches tall. So um, let's go ahead and attach this onto the bag. What I like to do is just line that up with the little top there and feed a ribbon through. Or you can use baker's twine or whatever you'd like to tie off your project with. And you can just tie a little, a little knot or a ribbon or a bow or whatever you want to do to finish off your project. With this double-sided ribbon, you kind of have to twist that other side to sh make it show correctly on the front. But how cute is that? It's perfect for a little gift card, little candies. You could use them as little table setting uh, favor boxes for Thanksgiving. Um, obviously we have our cute little Halloween and Christmas versions as well. Um, here's our Santa. And for Halloween we have the cute little bats. Wouldn't these be fun to give out to some of your um, nieces and nephews or kids for Halloween? 
some of your favorite little neighborhood kids that come by for Halloween. So I hope you have fun making these cute little tag bags and that you enjoy these little tags even for other occasions. And I hope you have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.